What's up, family? So I think it's important to understand that your name, your reputation, and your credibility are three very powerful things. I talk about this in one of my old videos about protecting your reputation from negative people. And to kind of build upon that, I want you guys to remember and understand that your reputation is like credit. When you say you will do something, people will believe you based upon who you are. Respect can go a very long way. So let's talk about some of the things that can happen if you don't protect your reputation, your credibility, and your name. So the first issue that might come up is fraudulence. So I always caution people to never attach their name to something that's potentially fraudulent, scammy, or the whole nine. If somebody asks you to promote something for them, you wanna make sure to do your due diligence to make sure that it's not a scam or something that could potentially be robbing people of their money. Even if they wanna compensate you for sharing their product or their service, you still wanna caution as to what you are promoting. Ultimately, making a quick buck isn't worth their reputation. Now, obviously, if this is somebody that's close to you, never giving you a reason to doubt them, then you don't have to be as strenuous on this one, but it is something to keep in mind. The next thing I wanna talk about is just the fact that people will try to lump you in with others as one big group whenever you've attached yourself to something that is scammy, all right? Think about it. If you have a job and people put you down as a reference and they get hired, you've now attached your name to that person who just got hired. Now, if they come up in there acting a fool, now everybody's gonna basically look at you and say, hey, well, you referred them, so this is on you. This also goes in the area of finances when people go to like loan cars or lease cars. Let's say you have great credit and you've co-signed for them. Now, if they stop making payments on it, something gets repoed or, you know, just any disaster happens, your name's on the hook too. And now you're going to have to pay for it. It's an issue of being guilty by association. And hey, even companies nowadays apply the same mentality, big or small. If somebody comes out on social media or just in public saying some crazy stuff and that company has a brand deal or a sponsorship with them, they're basically going to terminate the contract and say, we have no affiliation with this person. We don't agree with what they're saying, blah, blah, blah. So companies and businesses are not shy about dropping people when they could potentially be held liable for something. And you should be the same way. If somebody is coming around you and they can be a liability to your reputation, your respectability, and your name, you have to approach with caution or get as far away from them as possible. Simple as that. But yeah, guys, that's all I got for you today. As always, if you enjoyed this video, drop a like below, leave a comment sharing your thoughts, follow me on my socials, and subscribe for more.